Hey what's up guys, welcome to Trending Reviews. So today I've got this camera tripod, it's called the Andoa AO666. One of the reasons why I bought it is because I currently have two tripods at the moment. One is for my ring studio light and the other one is for my preamp which has a monitor sitting on top of it. So I wanted to get a separate one for my DSLR because my DSLR at the moment is sitting inside the little cold shoe that comes in between the ring light. So I wanted a separate one for this. So I bought this on Amazon, I've heard some good reviews about it. I'm going to give you a quick unboxing, give you a quick review on actually how the strong the build quality is and if, if it's fit for purpose and let me know what you guys think. So let's get straight into it. Alright, so let's go ahead and open this up. This is pretty cool. I didn't expect the uh, carry bag to be of this sort of a beige coloured camouflage carry case. I think that looks pretty awesome. I thought it would have been standard black or something like that. But let's go ahead. It's a pretty strong case as well. Alright, let's have a look what's in here. This is the Allen key that you use, I presume, for the ball head at the top. And the product manual is in there as well. Now the actual legs are 180 degree foldable. So they twist all the way around. Let's go ahead and do that for the three legs. There you go. And you can pretty much stand it in any direction you'd like. Now I like that it's got this little pouch at the top as well, so just open that. So it's got a little strap here as well, just if you want to carry it. Now this is actually pretty strong. So these are twisted parts that you can use to extend the legs. So you have four levels of extension on each leg, so you've got the little twisted knobs that you can just tighten it with. So if you loosen them up, you've got one, two, three and then for the last one overall this gives you a maximum height of 132 centimeters if you go for the model slightly higher than this the Q666 that will give you 150 centimeters of height in the tripod however this is for me enough for all the stuff that I want to do so I'm going to give a quick test on that right so one other thing to mention is that on each leg it comes with these clips that you have to pull outside to readjust them so you just put a little strength and it comes outside there as you can see and then that would basically allow you to adjust the legs by moving them in any direction you have 180 degrees to, to play with and you push it in and then it locks and then you can't really you can't pull them anymore into any direction the other thing that the bottom of the tripod comes with this little clip here now this is basically a counterweight so you can put some heavy weight on there as well to just keep the tripod in place so if you're having a camera down at a certain angle you feel like the tripod might tip over so this will counter that weight and just keep it locked down on the, the floor the other thing to note is one of the legs it basically converts into a monopod so this one with the gold ring around it you can basically twist that out it has a little uh, information telling you which way to unlock it so I'm gonna untwist it and take it out so that on its own becomes an extendable monopod and I can basically take off the top ball head and that basically will just screw it onto this and you can take that as a separate single standing camera tripod or you can use that to go hiking and use it as one of the hiking sticks right so now to talk about the top ball head so this is pretty heavy duty it comes with a 360 degree rotating camera holder so I just need to unscrew that a little bit and you can see that it just moves around in any direction at the same time you have a little gap there so that will allow the camera head to drop down and face right down to the floor or you can equally twist it and face the camera upwards to the ceiling so there's a various different angles that you can play with this which I think is really good and then you also have a quick release plate so you unscrew the top bit this bit comes out and then you just pull that out one other thing that I like about it it comes with a spirit level or a bubble level in a couple of different places so you have one here in the quick release plate handle there and you have one at the top here just next to the quick release plate as well so that's really good to make sure your video is steady and straight the other thing to note on this as well is that the ball head is actually twistable so even though it is quite locked in it's very sturdy you can actually twist it and get some nice pan shots when you're using your camera. Hold it still, use the actual tripod and then just twist to the top ball head and you'll get some really good footage as well. So I'm going to give you an example of that as well. Overall, 
I think the build quality is very strong. It's, it's heavy duty, it's made of aluminium. In terms of the price, it's just over 40 pounds, which I think is an excellent quality value for this type of tripod. I've seen very similar tripods to this, go ranging up to 100 pounds, possibly even more up to 150. So this will do just as good as a job as those ones as well. So let me go ahead and put this back together, put my camera on it, and I'll give you some really good footage on that as well. Alright guys, so that was just a quick run through of the tripod. I'm using that right now for my DSLR camera. It's going really well. I think I'm going to be using this permanently. I'm going to take it everywhere with me. It's very portable. I've got this awesome little carry case with it now as well. So let me know if you guys have any questions. Please do drop them down below. I hope you liked the video. Please do subscribe. I've got some really cool products coming up related to just the DSLR equipment that you can use for your YouTube videos, for reviews, for photography, for filming and so on. So keep an eye out for those. Other than that, thanks for watching guys. I will see you next time.